When you hear the words executive home, what comes to mind? I expect a home that's an executive home to have a high level of finishings. I expect there to be room on the wall to showcase art. I expect there to be a living quarters in the basement for a nanny. I expect a zero maintenance front and backyard. And I expect a place where I can entertain a lot of my colleagues and friends. Today, I wanna to show you that exact home. Now, we are in a low inventory market and homes that are great are incredibly hard to find. This one is great. Let's have a look at 5523 Deerhorn Lane. I'm Jeff Pershick with eXp Realty. And today we are in beautiful North Vancouver in the area of Grouse Woods. Stepping into this home, the first thing I feel is a sense of space. There is a huge foyer here with a coat closet, a laundry room, and I know exactly where I need to go when I walk in this home. It's incredibly well laid out with a family room, a dining area, and as an executive home, one of the most important features is the office. Let's take a look because you're gonna be impressed. An executive office should have three things. Number one, space to work. This office has two desks, both custom made. The second thing it should have is a television because sometimes it's nice after a long day to just close the door and catch up on the news without the interruptions of family and friends. The third thing it needs is natural light. And this office offers beautiful morning light facing east along with a deck outside. So if you need to go out and catch a breath of fresh air, you absolutely can. With over half a million dollars in renovations between 2016 and today, this house is impressive. I'm standing in the kitchen and family room area where the current owners have blown out two walls, extended the home back, and built a stunning backyard that looks onto Greenbelt. If you love entertaining and not cutting grass or picking weeds, this is the perfect home for you. Now, myself, you know already I love to cook. And the layout of this kitchen is something that I might copy if I ever build a house. We've got an island where there's four chairs to accommodate a family so you can actually look at each other and converse while you're having dinner. There are built-in electrical stations, a beautiful melee appliance set, the microwave, the stove, the induction oven, the dishwasher, the fridge, all melee. The other thing that's absolutely stunning about this home and that I would expect to find in any executive home is beautiful flooring. This is incredibly expensive French oak floors. All of the cabinets that you can see are solid wood. There isn't a piece of particle board in this home. In a world where everybody wants the best, but they don't wanna pay for it, this family chose to pay for it and it shows exquisitely. As a home that is truly built for entertaining, this is something you don't see very often. First of all, we've got two ovens, plus a warming oven, melee as well, that heats up to 400 degrees. You will never have a problem creating and sharing a variety of dishes in this kitchen. This home is not only an executive home, it's a well thought out home. As you can see behind me, there's a second door on the side of the house where the kids can come in. I'm standing in a bit of a mud room, so the kids come in, the groceries come in, the bags come in. You don't see them anywhere. They're kept out of the way so the rest of your home can be spotless or as close to. 
Here we are on the lower level of the home. If you have a nanny, or maybe you have live-in parents, or you have guests that stay for a few days at a time, this area is perfect. There's a fantastic bedroom, a three-piece bathroom, and it's all connected to a space where that person can have a TV area. It can also be used for a kid's playroom. If you love wine and scotch as much as I do, you will come here and hear the angels singing. This room is perfectly temperature controlled so that your wine stays immaculate for when you're ready to drink it. In the master bedroom of an executive home, you expect a spacious room that can easily accommodate a king-size bed. You expect a large walk-in closet and great natural light. Here, we go beyond those. We have an outlook onto the fully finished backyard, which allows sound from the creek that's behind the property to come in. It's an incredibly beautiful setting. The master bathroom has an oversized rain shower head. It's the biggest rain shower head I've ever seen. And one of the sellers actually says it's his favorite feature of the house. Now, what blew my mind when I came in here is that this master has two walk-in closets. And not only does it have two walk-in closets, it has two other closets. In addition to the master bedroom on the upper level, we have two other fantastic bedrooms, both of which share a beautiful bathroom and one of them has its own deck. The other bedroom has a place where kids can play hide and seek. So contact your realtor, contact me, come and see this house. A truly executive home has room for entertaining both indoor and out. As you can see, this backyard is built for having team building events, family over, friends, neighborhood parties, you name it, it's built for that. Now, not only is it incredible for entertaining, but one of the really unique features of this home is that it's got a dog run area with fake grass and you can put your dog there. It's fully fenced. They can do their thing. And the grass that was chosen has specific drainage and qualities so that whatever your dog does, it's not going to mess up the grass. So, Instead of taking your dog out for a walk in the middle of the night, you can just let them go out and they've got their own private space. After all, your dog's an executive too, right? This home, through its renovation, also has all new windows, doors, Hunter Douglas blinds, an air conditioning unit, and a variety of things that you really have to see in order to experience the quality of this executive home. I wanna thank you for taking time to watch this video. If you'd like more information about this property, please go to my website. You can contact me at jeffpershick.com. Yep, we're talking. We're talking? Am I really talking? Let's go for it. Where's the beef?